Mr. Phone, in view of your long public career, covering over a half a century, we'd like to get a statement from you. Some human interest anecdotes. Well, in my early youth... <laughs> hello, Dan. Why, hello, talkie. Glad we ran into you. Meet these ladies and gentlemen. They represent the press. It's a great pleasure. This is the youngest member of the family, but in many respects, the most active. <clears throat> uh, that is, next to myself. His full name is Talking Motion Picture. Any hot news from Hollywood? All the sound studios have cooling systems now. You seem in a hurry, Talkie. What's doing? I'm wiring a new theater down the street. Uh, there, where that crowd is. Why don't you all come down with me and catch the first show, Dad? Thanks, that'll be fine. We will. We will. He called Mr. Phone Dad, but I can't see just where he fits into the telephone family. Nevertheless, I am a direct descendant. Sound films are recorded in the studio by the condenser microphone, which is a development of the telephone transmitter, and are reproduced here in the theater through these loudspeaker horns, which are really powerful telephone receivers. Ah, oh, yes, I do get the connection. What's up, what's up, what's up, what's up? Talkie, we're in Dutch. The messenger with our film is in a taxi smash-up and can't get here in time. That crowd out there will scalp me. Anything to oblige? Ready? Aim? Sing! Oh, you little telephone, you're a perfect ear. We would give the world to know half the things you hear. When the boss needs something quick, on you we depend. And but for you, what would we do? You're more than just a friend. We love your welcome call. You've made the world seem small. Drinking 